Say hello to your brand new Corsa. We'd love to be showing you around in person, but right now, it's safer if you watch this video to get to know your new vehicle better. To keep you protected, your new car has been thoroughly cleaned and sanitized throughout. Now let us show you around. First, there's the key. You can lock and unlock by just pressing these buttons. Some models have keyless entry. Simply keep the key in your bag or pocket, walk up to the car and put your hand on the door handle. The door will unlock automatically and so will the boot. When you're inside, lock and unlock the car using these buttons. If your car is equipped with keyless start, press on the clutch pedal and the button to the left of the steering wheel to start the engine. For automatic, place your foot on the brake pedal instead. Also to the left of you is either a traditional handbrake or an electronic parking brake. Just push it down to switch off and pull up to switch back on again. Once inside, you can slide the seat backwards and forwards using the lever here, underneath the front seat. You can also adjust the angle of the backrest using this rotary wheel. You can use this lever here to move the front seat up and down. You can also adjust the steering wheel. Just pull this lever here under the steering wheel column. Then push the lever back into place to secure your position. The electric door mirrors can be adjusted using the controls on the door. Just push the switch left and right to adjust each door mirror. If your car has electrically folding door mirrors, leave the switch in the central position and then pull it back to fold the mirrors in. Before you set off, pull it back once more to fold them out. If your car has heated front seats, you can switch them on using this button, which has three heat settings. The heated steering wheel is activated using this button on the steering wheel. Some models come with massage seats, which you can switch on and off using the button on the right of the seat. Your new Corsa will either have air conditioning or electronic climate control. With electronic climate control, use the dial to set the temperature you want, push the auto button and it'll adjust the heater air conditioning and fan speed to your chosen temperature. To activate cruise control, just press this button here. To pause it, dab the brakes. You can reset it by flicking the thumb wheel back up again and deactivate it completely using this button again. With cruise control comes speed limiter. To turn it on, press here. You can then set the speed using the thumb wheel here and activate it using this button. Use that button again to pause it and to switch it off completely, press here. If your new Corsa has parking sensors, you can turn them on and off here. There's also a panoramic rear view camera on some models shown here on the main screen. There's more. Lane departure warning with lane assist gently nudges the steering wheel if you drift out of lane. This can be switched on and off again here. Speed sign recognition automatically detects road warning signs and highlights speed limits for you. Your car may also have Vauxhall Connect, which works through an app on your mobile. There's an emergency call and breakdown button above the rear view mirror. Simply go online to connect.voxall.co.uk to create your account. In the centre of the dashboard is your infotainment system. You'll have a 7-inch or a 10-inch touchscreen. To connect via Bluetooth, press the phone button, then options, Bluetooth connection and connect using your phone. Or you can search for BT Vauxhall on your phone and confirm the code. For Apple CarPlay or Android Auto, plug in the phone using a USB cable. You also control the DAB digital radio using the touchscreen. Save your favourite stations by selecting a radio station and holding a number at the bottom of the screen. If you have SatNav, press the Nav button to access it. Choose between a 2D or 3D setting and enter your destination. The points of interest function will help you find your nearest dealership, hotel or petrol station. The lighting controls are to the right of the steering wheel on this cluster. You have the side and dipped light settings, which you can switch on and off here. If you have automatic lighting, you'll also see an auto setting, which means they'll adjust automatically depending on the lighting outside. Moving to the back of the car, the rear seats can be lowered using these latches at the top and side of the rear seats. Just pull the latch and then pull the seat towards the front of the car and it will fold down. To put them back, pull the red tab until you hear it click back into place. Also in the rear seats are two Isofix child seat mounting points. There's also a third Isofix mounting point in the front. Check your owner's manual before using this seat, as you may need to manually turn off the airbag. 
To activate child-proof locks, turn the red child lock in the rear door inwards to the horizontal position by using a key. Be sure to test the doors are locked. To deactivate, turn the child lock to the vertical position. To open the bonnet, pull the handle in the front. Lift the catch under the bonnet and use the strut to hold it open. You'll find the washer fluid here and the oil dipstick here. The dipstick location might vary, so just look out for the orange or yellow coloured cap. The fuel cap is on the passenger side of the vehicle. To open, simply unlock your car, push it open and unscrew the cap. You can also hook the cap onto the flap to keep it out of the way. If you have a diesel engine, you'll also notice a smaller blue cap, which is for refilling the AdBlue tank. If your Corsa is fitted with the blue injection system, it'll need AdBlue refills about every 2,500 to 4,000 miles, depending on your engine and driving style. Your dashboard indicator will alert you when any fluid levels are low. Moving on, your boot will unlock automatically if you have keyless entry. If not, use the button just under the Vauxhall badge. Under the floor of the boot, you'll see a tyre inflation kit or a spare wheel. Your new Corsa has a tyre pressure monitoring system to warn you if any tyres drop below their correct pressure. If you've got automatic wipers, push up the stalk to the right of your steering wheel once to set automatic wipers, which will then adjust to the rain outside. If you need to change the setting, use the centre of the stalk to increase or decrease wiper speed. Otherwise, simply push up the stalk further for constant low speed and up again for the fastest speed. To control the rear wiper, twist the end of the stalk. Pull the stalk towards you to squirt wiper wash on your front screen and away from you to wash the rear screen. Your Corsa comes with a three-year vehicle warranty, a one-year unlimited mileage warranty, then your second and third years with a 60,000 mile limit. Vauxhall Assistance comes with every new Vauxhall for 12 months from first registration and covers accident assistance, roadside recovery and an at-home service. Even better, it's a free phone call away and available 24 hours a day, 365 days a year. If you have any questions, your local retailer will be happy to help. We hope you enjoy your new Corsa.